we started tracking, um, we we realized that we, there was quite a big impact of lockdown on the number of deaths. And that was particularly noticeable in, in the unnatural deaths. And by unnatural, we mean the, the um, road accidents and and murders and suicides and other accidents and with the lockdown and um, less people on the roads and also probably the, the alcohol restrictions um, there, there was an immediate drop almost to a half of what it was previously in the unnatural deaths but in the in the natural deaths, that is the um, deaths from aging or from uh, diseases, cancers or TB, whatever the the natural causes of death, um, we also saw that there was a bit of a drop, um, not not to the extent of of the unnatural, but it started tracking not. The, the predicted level but tracking lower than the predicted level so it started going up to as we came into winter but it was tracking lower we we think that and and um, we don't have access to the data that could tell us exactly what it is but we do think that um, with lockdown, there, there was uh, certainly an impact on the flu epidemic that we usually have in winter. Um, there's been no sign of flu as this year. Um, the social distancing and the hand washing, um, probably also wearing masks would, would have affected that as well. And we think it's probably affected other infectious diseases such as diarrheal disease and, and um, we unfortunately don't know exactly, but um, what we see is that it tracks a little bit lower than, than what would have been predicted.